It's time to learn how to download and install the driver for use on the Mac computer with your Qsera MA6000 IFX printer. Begin by printing a status page. On the control panel of your printer, click on the system menu counter key. Now on the left, click on notification report. On the right side, click on print report list. A list of reports to print will appear. Click on status page. You will be asked, are you sure? Press on print. The screen will state accepted and the status page will print out. The machine will now produce a status page. Look for network and then find the IP address listed. Copy the address down on a piece of paper. You will need this information later. Now we will download the latest Mac driver. Go to https colon forward slash forward slash kiosera.info. This will take you to the download center. Here you should select your country or region. In our example, we are using USA. In the refine the product area, type in MA6000 IFX. Now click on the Ecosys MA6000 IFX. Select your operating system from the list. In our example, we're using Mac OS X 10.9 or later. Scroll down and find the Mac printer driver 10.9 and up. Click on the blue download button as shown. A license agreement will appear. Scroll to the bottom. Select the agree to contract and download blue button. Open the download zip file. The Kyocera OS X 10.9 file ending in DMG will appear. Double click on the file. You have three options to use. Kyocera OS X 10.9 Plus Web Build Package, Mac Driver Setup Guide, or the Uninstaller Guide. Double click on the first option. Click Continue. Click Continue again. Click Continue one more time. Click on Agree to continue installing the software. Next, click on Install. If a password is asked for, please enter it. This software will begin to install. This may take a few minutes, so please be patient. When the install is completed, a green check mark will appear. Click on Close. You can keep the install file or move it to the trash. Go to System Preferences, Printers and Scanners. Click on the plus button. At the top of the Add Printer screen, click on the IP button located here. Type in the IP address located in this block. You'll find the IP address you printed earlier. At the bottom of the page, type in the name you wish to give your new printer. You can change the name of the printer to whatever you want. In our example, we will type in My Kyocera Printer. Go to Use and scroll down to click on Select Software. The Printer Software window will now appear. In the search box, type in MA6000. Below, your Kyocera Ecosys MA6000 IFX KPDL will appear. Assure it is highlighted and then click on OK. Next, click on Add in the bottom right of the screen. The Setting Up My Kyocera Printer page will appear. Click on OK. You'll find your printer here. You may share the printer on the network by clicking on the Sharing Preferences button. You can also make your newly installed Kyocera printer your default printer, meaning any print job from the computer will automatically print to your Kyocera printer. Select the default paper size you'll be using. In most cases, you'll be printing U.S. letter. To close out, click on the Back button at the top left of the printer and Scanners window, and then click on the red Close button. You have now downloaded and installed the Mac driver for your Kyocera MA6000 IFX printer.